Our responsive reading this morning is taken from the Old Testament prophet Isaiah. I invite you to follow along on the screen. I'll read the first, you read the uh, second, and back and forth. It's entitled, The Lamb of God. Who has believed what we have heard? And to whom has the arm of the Lord been revealed? For he grew up before him like a young plant and like a root out of dry ground. He had no form or comeliness that we should look at him and no beauty that we should desire him. He was despised and rejected by men, a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. And as one from whom men hid their faces, he was despised and we esteemed him not. Surely he has borne our griefs and carried our sorrows. Yet we esteemed him stricken, smitten by God, and afflicted. But he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. Upon him was the chastisement that made us whole. And with this, his stripes, we are healed. All we like sheep have gone astray. We have turned every one to his own way. And the Lord has laid on him the iniquity of us all. He was oppressed and he was afflicted. Yet he opened not his mouth. Like a lamb that is led to the slaughter, and like a sheep that before its shears is dumb, so he opened not his mouth. By oppression and judgment he was taken away. And as for his generation, who considered that he was cut off out of the land of the living, stricken for the transgression of my people? Yet it was the will of the Lord to bruise him. He has put him to grief. Therefore I will divide him a portion with a great, and he shall divide the spoil with a strong. Because he poured out his soul to death and was numbered with the transgressors, yet he bore the sin of many and made intercession for transgressors. <clears throat> 